Hey guys, this is That Snazzy iPhone Guy, and this is part three to Idiot's Guide to Jailbreaking. Alright, so um, you have your phone, and it's in DFU mode. Uh, now, oh, I forgot to tell you, before you stick it in DFU mode, back everything up. Back all your music up, back all your applications off, because once it's in DFU mode, there's no turning back. You have to restore. Okay? So, um, <laughs> I forgot to mention that. Do that. Um, now that it's in DFU mode, you flip open your computer screen and uh, you go to that lovely application everyone loves and everyone hates at the same time called iTunes. Okay, I'm going to plug my phone in so iTunes will recognize it. Now mine is not actually in DFU mode because I don't want to restore my phone, but pretend it is and uh, I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, so you launch iTunes and uh, while it's loading, it's going to bug me about the new 8.0.2 firmware update, blah, 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 blah. Oh, another thing. Uh, when I jailbroke it, it did not work with um, 8.0 firmware. So, don't do that. Okay. Crap. Did my Ethernet cable come loose? Hurry up. Come on now. Okay. Nope. It's fine. So, your devices pops up. Now, there's going to be a big red alert that pops up. None of this is going to be here. This will be gone. The top will be gone. It'll say summary. All the information is gone. There's one button, and it'll say broken phone or whatever. It doesn't say broken phone. It's not broken. It'll say, and then there will be a pop-up box that'll say, your iPhone has been detected, and it's in recovery mode. Would you like to restore it to the original firmware? And you say yes. And uh, so... But, 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 if you click restore and okay, it will put the original Apple firmware on there. So what you have to do, avert your eyes to the keyboard, you push option, control, I don't remember, option, and then you go up to the screen, hold that down, and then uh, push that button, restore, right there. Now a menu pops up, yay. So then you go in. You go to your Ponage Tool folder, and uh, I don't actually have one here because I didn't rebuild my firmware, uh, but there will be this one right here, iPhone 1, 2, 2.2, restore. And then there will be another one, iPhone 1.2, 2.25, G77, custom restore. Choose the custom restore ISPW. Now, I don't have one, so I'm just going to click cancel. But what you'll do, you'll select it, you'll push choose, it'll say, now this will delete all your information, but it's already deleted, so it doesn't matter. And then you push yes. And uh, iPhone or iTunes just plays it like it is. Um, make sure you have your Ethernet cable in, make sure you're connected to the Internet, or else iTunes has a heart attack. Um, so that is pretty much it. Once you get there, you can add music, add photos, sync with mobile me, do everything you did before. It's just unlocked. So iTunes is stupid. It doesn't know that you have a jailbroken phone. Um, so it's really neat, really good, and uh, it's well worth a try, guys. Um, once again, if you're scared, if you don't want to kind of have that, if you don't have that hacker in you, don't try it, because uh, you got to have confidence or else you're not going to get anywhere. So, um, yeah, guys, that's it. That is part three um, to Idiot's Guide to Jailbreaking. Um, just a few things in closure. Make sure you enter the contest. It ends Tuesday, December 23rd, and uh, that's that. So thank you so much, guys, for watching. This is That Snazzy iPhone Guy, and uh, we're going to go to part four um, called Cool Things Your iPhone Can Do. Thank you, guys. This is That Snazzy iPhone Guy, and uh, I'm going to be checking out here. So um, I'm going to see you right next in part four, but until I see you, stay snazzy. Thanks, guys.